And now here's the stars of the show. Please give a warm welcome to Carlo Russo and Lou Greco. Oh, calm down, everybody. Yeah, calm yeah, down. Calm is. down. The stars of the show. Hey. Calm down. Take All these people easy, in this room. Calm down. Yelling. What's up, everybody? What the heck? Is that my camera right there? That's, hey, everyone. Uh, number two. Number two. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the Fat Coffee After Hours. In a Thursday night. Right. We are... Um, we are actually not drinking fat coffee. We are drinking a little bit. Well, I am a yeah. little bit of whiskey. A little bit of whiskey. I mean, no whiskey for I me. Uh, I got my whiskey. Lou's got his little juicy. Got Michael and, uh, the people. I won't, I won't say what Z's drinking. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Thank you for uh, having us here again at the at the D. What's going on? Not too much, man. Um, some sad news this week, of yeah. course, and I, we lost Carlos Idol this this past uh, week, man. Right. Right, we, we lost his idol this past week, so not, uh, not doing so good. Eddie Van Halen. Yeah, yeah. I'm not doing oh so my good. God, I uh, I thought, you know, I I, I uh, can we start just talking about it? Of course. Um, and I know everybody that's our age that's watching Van Halen was, and I like to say it was like a sound, it was like a a backdrop of our lives. You know, the music was like this the soundtrack it's of my life of, at least yeah, since I was part of everybody. Before, up. Yeah, I was 12 years old, but I found out in a weird way. Louie and I were doing videos that day, and I got a message from Z, and earlier that day, Z and I talked, and I was like in a weird mood. I was like in a bum mood. I, I was feeling kind of bum. Had nothing to do with Van Halen. Didn't even know he passed away yet. Um, so then about, I don't know, was it 3 o'clock? You, you emailed me and said, hey, bud, how you doing? Yeah, I was checking on you. I was, you go, hey, bud, I was how, concerned. Right. You go, hey, bud, how you doing? Now, of course, I didn't know that he passed away. So I'm thinking from the discussion we had in the morning, uh -huh. you're just checking on if I've gotten a better mood. Right. And I'm like, I, I, I actually looked at Lou. I go, oh, my God, I must have been really bad this morning because Z's checking up on me. <laughs> <laughs> so at that moment, I get in the car, and I, was, I got a call from my brother, and he said that something happened to my mom. And so I said, well, while I'm here, I'll go to my mom's house. I go in the door, and my brother goes, oh, did you know that Eddie Van Halen died today? And that's how I heard about it. I'm like, Excuse me, what? And I didn't have time to kind of register because I was worried about my mother, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know. So then I'm, I'm I'm dealing with my mom, and I figure that out. So I get in the car afterwards, and it finally hit me, like, oh my god, Eddie Van Halen's gone. Yeah. That's crazy. It's because you you think of Van Halen, and you you always think of different parts of your life where you were listening to yeah, them. Yeah, the soundtrack. Like right? my whole thing was the summer. They, I think it was 87, maybe it was 86, summer of 86. Uh -huh. That's when their 5150 came out. When yeah. did 5150 come 85, out? 85, 86. 80, 85, well, 86, 84, 86. After 80, 80, it was 86. I 86, had to yeah. right? And it was the summer, and I'm driving my Cadillac. Cause I had a Cadillac. I'm Italian. Of course. Of course you did. I had an Eldorado, <laughs> and I'm flying down, and it was uh, summer nights. Summer nights. That oh, and yeah. what we heard today. I remember cranking it and just <laughs> winding my hair back in the he day. He had hair, yep. Yep, and uh, in my Cadillac, going to the beach. And, you know, just a soundtrack. It just yeah. brings you right back to there when you start thinking, oh, my God, he's dead. He's dead and, now, so you start thinking of those memories. And, and the crazy thing is, um, I, I'm, I do what I, I do, like on stage and all that. And I, I, I always think of listening to Eddie and Elvis was a huge. Elvis has been a big icon of mine, and and, and Eddie, um, and they got me into like I want to be, a, I want to be an entertainer. I, that's what made me want to be what we are doing. Uh, looking up to these guys and 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 just all these different things that go through your mind. I had the last four decades rushing through my head, like just like old friends and girlfriends and situations and and like you said, driving the Cadillac, listening to that yeah. song. And I'm sure Z, you have many stories. For, uh, for me, it was going to the Mid State Skating Arena. If oh. any locals that are watching this uh -huh. can remember Mid State Skating Arena, skating around the rink in 1984, 85, and it jump. was like that jump was huge in yeah. Panama. And, you know, uh, Top Jimmy was always one of my Top favorite Jimmy. songs. Oh, so, God. Yeah, of course. I mean, it painted the soundtrack, the fabric of my life, yeah. especially throughout the 80s Absolutely. and early 90s. Like I told Lou, um, I told Lou today, we were driving up here, and I said, the worst thing about it is when you're alive, you can create more, right? I mean, there's like, even if you don't, 
there's still a possibility of a new Van Halen song or a new Van Halen lick. You know, even if it was 70, there, there's still a possibility. Now it's it's done. There's no more creation. There might be yeah. old songs that never were released uh, that you might hear. And, you know, with the Internet now, I think I've heard them all, like, you know, all the, all, you know, the, the hidden treasures kind of thing. But there's no more creation. There's, you'll never hear that again. You'll can, never, you'll can, never see a new Van Halen. In one shot across the world, every guitar player on the planet cried. Is yeah. just that was a for just a second. It went, oh yeah, man. like a family member, just man. Just the, the wind yeah. out of the sails. One fell swoop. That's it. I think anybody our age group, like them or not, if you picked up electric guitar, the name Eddie Van Halen went through your mind. Mm -hmm. Right. I mean, even if you weren't a Van Halen fan, you know, Eddie Van Halen, bass players, drummers, singer, anything that you are. And then yeah. when my father and mother know Van Halen and they're 84 years old, you know what I mean? It when an 84 like, year old Italian like when, people, uh, you know, Neil Peart passed away. Right. Which the was drummers, earlier which this was year, insane, too. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, and all the drummers. Now we're going to see. Well, stuff all over yeah, social Eddie media. Now everybody's going to be doing eruption. I think you know what? Here's I've something. seen a bunch already. Oh, yeah. yeah, they should all do eruption at the same time and do like a Zoom with a million guys doing it at the same time. Well, <laughs> like it's funny cool you say that because yesterday was everybody was told at eight o'clock yesterday night to crank eruption all at the same time. Oh, really? So it's played worldwide. Oh.